part of me that really truly is an artist i haven't even been able to accept that like i'm not good enough to be an artist is how i've viewed myself for so long like i'm only good enough to be second seat or supporting the artist but i'm not an artist i'm just the support guy you know and so wrong. that's yeah but it's it's taken years and years and then then now a you know a divorce and a lot of you know, meditation and reflection and therapy and books and talking through a lot of stuff and realizing like, oh, like I've, I've been viewing myself like I'm garbage and I'm not like at all. <laughs> and so that's changing my perspective on myself. And so I'm actually like getting excited. And I know, you know how it is. You record something or you write something or you produce something and then you release it and you get like two likes on Facebook. And it can, if you're not mature enough, just destroy your self-esteem. Like it, it's really hard. <laughs> yeah. Well, and sometimes it's just because you didn't know how to promote it or whatever. And, and we're, we're sadly so fragile. We are so fragile. I and, mean, yeah embarrassingly fragile. no one would know no one would know